In this project, we're 3D printing molds to make DIY bath bombs. This is a pretty fun way to make custom bath bombs, soap, or even chocolate just in time for that special Hallmark holiday. We've remixed the design from our previous Stocking D20 project and simplified it a bit so that it's easier to demold. You can also modify the design if you'd like. We have the download link in the description. The two parts don't need any support material and each takes about 30 minutes to 3D print. You could also try using water soluble filament which lets you print more details and you won't have to demold because it dissolves in water. The main ingredients are baking soda, citric acid, and cornstarch, which also holds everything together. But you should also try experimenting with different scents and colors. To keep the ingredients from activating while mixing, you want to add the liquids in at a small amount of time. Once it's all nicely blended, you'll need to pack the mix into the molds as tightly as possible. And it's a good idea to pack more than necessary so that the two halves actually fuse together. Join the two halves together by pressing them tightly and remove the excess from the sides. You want to try to smooth out those edges so that there's less of a seam. Now to hold the parts together, we'll just use a few rubber bands. And once that's done, we can let the bath bombs dry overnight, or for faster drying, you could just pop them in the freezer for about a half an hour. With our mix fully dry, we can demold by tapping on the sides until they come loose. And that's pretty much it. There we have it, our icosahedron bath bomb. Now all that's left to do is to toss it in the bathtub and enjoy. These are pretty great to customize with different colors and scents. It's a lot of fun for kids too. So how would you guys customize your bath bombs? You can let us know in the comments. And thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more 3D printing projects from Adafruit.